Manish Sainani graduated from a law degree four years ago and is still looking for a job. He voted for the first time this election and believes the BJP party will be able to create more jobs. Two thirds of India's population is under 35, and the country officially has a 13% youth unemployment rate. The BJP won 282 out of 545 seats in the House of Representatives, making it the first political party in the last 30 years to win such a clear-cut majority. Political analyst Vivek Sharma, who also voted for the BJP, says this will give them the power to create change. जिसे कहते हैं ना अंतरराष्ट्रीय वो दबदबा नहीं रहा था भारत का छोटे-छोटे देश देश भारत को आंखें दिखाने लग गए थे आप देखिए मोदी जी की सरकार में क्रांतिकारी परिवर्तन आएंगे कांग्रेस पार्टी के साहजादे अ ब्रिलियंट स्पीकर नरेंद्र मोदी रन एन इफेक्टिव नेशन वाइड कैंपेन दैट फोकस्ड ऑन रिवाइटलाइजिंग द इकॉनमी एंड फाइटिंग करप्शन ऑल्दोथ द नेशनलिस्ट हिंदू पार्टी हैज अ डार्क पास्ट corruption scandals and ineffective leadership of the last Congress government gifted the party with a strong win. Local journalist Prem Shankar Sharma says people are hungry for change. Now, in the last two or three years, the government was so hard that the government was so hard that the government was so hard. The government was so hard that the government was so hard. The government was so hard that the government was so hard. India's new Prime Minister is a divisive politician loved and loathed in equal measure. He's accused of doing little to stop the 2002 religious riots when more than a thousand people, mostly Muslims, were killed. Allegations he consistently denies. In fact, Modi ji has won the Hindu agenda. He has won the Hindu vote for Hindu vote. He has won the Hindu vote for Hindu vote. If you go to that, the Hindu vote for 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 Hindu vote. He also points out that in terms of the popular vote, the majority voted against the BJP. Internationally, Mr Modi also has a checkered reputation. After the anti-Muslim riots, the US denied him visas and the UK cut off all ties with him. But now, a decade later, the controversial politician has been reintegrated into the political mainstream. Supreme Court का direction पे वो SIT कार्रवाई कर रही थी और उस SIT ने मोदी जी को बिल्कुल clean चिट दे दी है। ये सारे के सारे विपक्ष के आरोप है। But he's never expressed any remorse or offered any apologies for the riots, and many Muslims displaced by the violence continue to live in ghettos. और अगर आप हिंदुत्ववादी एजेंडे पे चलते हैं तो आप धर्मनिरपेक्षवादियों के सामने खलनायक के रूप में उभरेंगे जैसा कि अभी भी वो हैं। वोट बटोरने के लिए आप निश्चित रूप से जनता को उकसा सकते हैं, सारी बातें ठीक हैं, उसका आपको फायदा भी मिला है, वोट भी मिले हैं, सब चीजें। लेकिन अब आप उनके उम्मीदों पे खरा उतरेंगे संभव नहीं है। ग्रामीण में तो ये है कि जो बेरोजगार लोग हैं, चाहे वो किसानों में से हों, तो उनके लिए वहाँ कृषि का मतलब डेवलपमेंट जो असंख्य जमीन है, उसके लिए संचित के मतलब या और ये रोड है, रोड नहीं है गांव में, लाइट नहीं है, तो इनका मतलब ये है कि विकास कराया जाए, ये हम सरकार से, भावी सरकार से, Narendra Modi himself comes from a humble background. As a child, he sold tea on the streets. Now he's the leader of the world's largest democracy.